Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to talk about how to verify your identity in Upwork. In this video we will do a walkthrough of the Upwork interface and show you what are the requirements for the verification process and how to complete it. So watch this video till the end to better understand all these steps. After successfully logging in or signing up you will be taken to your dashboard. Let's first do a walkthrough of the interface and after that we shall proceed to the verification process. On the top search bar if you click on it you will see three options which are jobs, talent and projects. You can use this search bar to search across these three categories. Below at the top of the job feeds you will also see a search bar. You can use it to search for a specific job and the relevant results will be shown. Here in your job feed, you will see three different tabs which are best matches, most recent and saved jobs. If you look at any of the job posts, on the top you will see its title and below that you will see the job type, whether it has an hourly rate or a fixed price. If it is an hourly rate project, you will see its rate range. And if it is a fixed price project, you will see its rate along with the experience level and the time it was posted. Below is the description and the skills needed for this project. Below you will see the number of proposals this job has received. And lastly, you will see its payment verification status, review stars of the client, how much the client has spent on Upwork and the country of origin of the client. With this thumbs down icon, you can report this job and using this heart icon, you can add it to your save jobs list. Here in the top navigation bar, you will see four tabs, which are find work, my jobs, reports and messages. If you hover your cursor on find work, you can access the sections like save jobs, proposals, profile, my stats and my project dashboard. If you hover your cursor on my jobs, you can access my jobs, all contracts and work diary. If you hover your cursor on reports, you can access overview, my reports, billings and earnings, connects history, transaction history and the certificate of earnings sections. Under the Messages tab, you can see all your conversations with clients, recruiters, agencies and Upwork themselves. If you click on your profile icon, from here you can change your status to online or invisible. And if you have both a freelancer and a client account, you can switch between them from here. Click on the Settings tab and you will be asked to enter your password to continue. After that, you will be taken to the settings page. In the left sidebar, you will see two sections. First is billing, which has only one tab of billing and payments. And second is the user settings, which has tabs of membership and connects, contact info, tax information, my profile, profile settings, get paid, my teams, connected services, password and security, identity verification and notification settings. Let's move on to the verification process. Click on the identity verification tab and you will see your identity verification status. As this profile is already verified, you will see here that it has been verified in two ways. The first is ID document verification and here is the date when it was successfully verified. And the second is visual verification and here is the date when it was successfully verified. To know more about this verification process, click on the help icon on the top navigation bar and then select help and support. On this help page from here you can select your account type to see a more personalized section. And below you will see the help categories. Here you can see that the account category has content for account settings, service options and identity verification, so click on it. On this account page, scroll down to see the identity verification section. Let's first see the verification badge. Click on ID verification badge. 
On this page, you can see that Upwork says, once you've verified your identity, we'll put an identity verified badge on your profile. The badge displays as a check mark next to your name. This lets anyone who sees your profile know that we have taken steps to confirm that you are who you say you are. Scroll down and in the FAQ section, you will see, how do I become eligible to earn this badge? Upwork says, we'll let you know when it's time to verify your identity. You won't be able to do so until we request verification. We'll send you an email and notify you when you sign in to your account if you need to verify. This means that you can't do the verification process until and unless Upwork asks you to verify your identity. And when Upwork asks for verification, then the Identity Verification tab will appear under your User Settings section. To know more methods of identity verification, click on the Types of ID Verification text. On this page, you can see that you can verify your identity in three different ways, which are Garment ID Verification, Garment ID plus Residency Verification, and video verification. Click on government ID verification. On this page, here you will find what types of documents are required. And here you will find what types of documents will not be accepted for verification. The second type of verification is government ID plus residency verification. Click on it. This type of verification can be done only when Upwork sends you a form asking for your government-issued ID, card or passport and a document that verifies your residency. On this page, you will find details about the identity review process, documents required, image guidelines and much more. And the third and last type of verification is video verification. Click on it. On this page, you will find a detailed description about visual verification you can do this verification in two ways. First is digital photo verification. While most freelancers must verify by video call, some will be eligible for digital photo verification or selfie verification instead. To complete digital photo verification, Upwork will ask you to take a photo of yourself on your computer or mobile device. To do this verification, you can follow these steps which will only take a few minutes. Second is video verification. To complete video verification, Upwork will invite you to have a video call via Google Meet. An Upwork representative will ask you a few questions to confirm the information in your profile. Upwork may also request that you show proof of identity such as a garment issued ID during the call. Here are the tools needed before starting the video verification process and below are the steps that should be followed to complete the video call. With this, we have completed our tutorial on how to verify your identity in Upwork. This brings this video to an end. We truly hope you liked it. If you have any suggestions or want us to make a video on any specific topic, feel free to comment below. We'll see you soon in our next video. Till then, stay tuned and stay subscribed to our channel.